Hey me again. Um, so I'm recording this video just to show you how to track uh, churn. All right. So you'll have uh, two. You'll have links to these two documents. So you'll you'll need those two documents to calculate the churn. Um, and you need to have, of course, access to the Facebook group. So what you need to do is every day during the week, um, starting from Tuesday, you want to go and uh, find out how many new customers uh, did we add and how many customers did we lose and put in the total number so what you need to do is for instance if I want to track um, the numbers for Monday um, you need to you need to wait until Tuesday to track Monday's numbers because the data updates every 24 hours okay so if you want to track Tuesday's number um, you want to wait until Wednesday, right? So, so today is um, Thursday. Now I need to track um, Wednesday's number. So what I need, it, what I do is I drag this down so that it fills up the date. Um, then what I do is I first go to Facebook and I click on members. I go to the Facebook uh, page. I click on members. Then I click here on. Uh, filter members by join date right so first what I want to find is I want to find the number of new members we added yesterday and what you do is you hover over the hour uh, over the date and okay so you hover over the date and then and then a pop-up uh, you'll see this pop-up that will give you the date and um, time so to find out like when they join just uh, hover over the date here and it will give you the exact uh, date so it seems like we only added one new member so you go back to r047 and you put in column b you put one <clears throat> so then what you do is you go to um sfs orders document and you see how many members do we have on there those are the ones that we're, we'll, we'll be taking out and you count them so we have 23 members so what you do now is um, you take the overall number of members this is the formula you take the overall number of members you deduct you deduct uh, the number uh, the number of members um, that will be taking out which you get from the SFS orders document which is 23 then what you do is you deduct 37 number 37 and you'll come up with 944 so you just put here 944 and that's uh and then you just um copy this and just um replace this number with how many members will be removing from sfs and that would be 23 so you're good um you know this is basically the whole uh, process uh, if you would please um, uh, document this um, so we can add it to the um, daily um, uh, procedure uh, daily task and teamwork all right if you have any questions please let me know thank you